Hello everyone, my name is Aksa and I'm from University Technology Petronas, Malaysia. In this short video, we will learn about soap production from waste cooking oil using simple apparatus at home. First, I will show you the material or chemicals that we need to produce about half liter of liquid soap. 1. Waste cooking oil. We need 100 ml of waste cooking oil. Try to filter and remove any solid from your waste cooking oil using strainer that you have in your kitchen. If you do not have one, you can buy from the DIY store that will probably cost about 2 ringgit. 2. Water. We need approximately 400 to 500 ml of water, depend on how viscous the soap that you want at the end. In this video, we use 400 ml. 3. Potassium hydroxide or KOH. We need roughly about 20 gram or 20 ml of it. If you have a small balance, you can use it to weight the potassium. Or if you don't have one, you can put the potassium first in the measuring cup up to 20 to 25 ml. 4. Fragrance. You can use any kind of fragrance or essential oil such as lavender, rose, or lemon. You can buy this from online shop such as Lazada or Shopee and it will cost you around 5 to 10 ringgit per 10 milliliter. You can also use orange fruit peel alternatively. In this video, we use about 1 to 2 milliliter of fragrance, depend on the preference. And that's all the ingredient that you need. For safety precaution, please use Google or face shield and phenyl gloves that you can get from DIY store. Keep in mind that KOH or potassium is a strong chemical and can cause irritation if it touches your skin. It can also generate some heat up to 70 to 80 degrees Celsius when mixed or diluted in water. Step 1. Measure 100 ml waste cooking oil and put it in a cup or beaker glass. Step 2. Measure a 50 ml of water and put it in a cup or beaker glass. Step 3. Measure 20 gram or 20 to 25 ml of potassium and dilute it a little by little into the water. The mix will generate some heat up to 70 degrees Celsius, so please be careful. Step 4. After diluting the potassium, we can now mix it with the waste cooking oil. Step 5. If you have a magnetic stirrer like this, you can set the temperature to 60 degrees Celsius and use it to heat up and stir the mixture for about 2 hours. Step 6. During the reaction, you can add water a little by little up to 350 milliliter. So in total, you will have about 500 milliliter or half a liter of soap. Step 7 or the final step. Try to cool down the soap before adding the fragrance. You can still add more water based on your preference. Thank you for watching this short video and I hope we all can reduce our kitchen waste and convert it into something useful. Thank you and see you again. This video has been brought to you by the support of Institute of Self-Sustainable Building, University Technology Petronas, Malaysia.